Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Amanda. I am a part-time reseller on Kitizen, Poshmark, Mercari, dabble in a couple other places, but I do this for fun and mostly I do this to get items for my own family for free and it's just my joy. It's my hobby and it's just, it brings me joy. Do more of what brings you joy and everything else in your life just becomes more happy. So today I have an unboxing for you. I have shared this company before. I am not an affiliate. I don't get a discount. I don't get anything for sharing this with you guys. I wish I did, but um, the company is called Bulk, B-U-L-Q. You've heard me share about this. So here's a better, um, it is, I would, it's kind of like liquidation, but you can get uninspected returns or brand new items. And what I've gathered is that all of the items come from either Target, Amazon, or Kohl's. I don't know if there's any other places, but what I love about it is that it's not a mystery per se, like many of the other unboxings that you might see from my channel and from other resellers. It is manifested inventory, which means you can click on a box and you're literally going to see a spreadsheet of what comes inside of it. And what I love about them is that if there's an Amazon link, you can literally click on it and it will take you and show you the exact price that you can buy it for right now. That if it's from Target, you can find the stock photos. It's just great for reselling. But for me, I, of course, you know, I want to resell some of these items. But what I have found to love from this website is that you can use the search function. And we went on a vacation recently. I needed sunscreen. I needed goggles earlier this summer. Uh, at one point, I needed some uh, skincare, like some face moisturizer that had SPF in it. And so you can go on their website, type in the search bar, anything you're looking for. I'm talking, maybe you need some new pots and pans in your kitchen. Maybe you need a phone case, uh, flip flops, a certain brand. Like I particularly love the joy lab brand from target. So anyway, you can search and it will pull up anything that you need. So for this box, I just love getting things delivered to my front door. I like to online shop. And I, uh, school is starting for us here next week. I needed some socks for my kids. So that's kind of what I started looking for when I purchased this box and just a couple other pieces of school clothes. We're going to a new school where we don't need uniforms. So anyway, all of that to say, that's what's in this box. This is a clothing and apparel box. I would say like 85% of it, I knew what was in it. There was maybe a few pieces that were categorized as swimwear like unmanifested swimwear i think there was like 10 of those so let's dig in and show you guys what i got um i am we were outside all day today so i know y'all love me for my keeping it real no makeup no i mean i just show up how i am so uh this box was 43 dollars. their shipping is always 30 dollars for the boxes i always sort only by boxes i don't even look at the pallets i'm just not interested in that yet so with tax and everything, this box was $75.19. I know myself, if I go to Target, I'm going to spend at least that, even if I go into the store for just socks. So to me, it was worth it. There were 67 items in this box, and that breaks out my cost of goods to $1.12 per item, which I personally think is great, especially once you see what I got. All right, so we're just gonna jump in. These are some Cat and Jack boxer briefs. Uh, these are a size large, 12, 14, my 10 year old. These will fit him when he's going to college at this point, he's just so skinny. So um, certain items I might keep in my size up bins and other items I'm going to go ahead and list on my platform. All right, these are a Cat and Jack uh, size, extra large, 14, 16. Um, what are these? Bicycle shorts, underdress shorts, whatever. I am going to take several of these pieces to my local Once Upon a Child. I'm going tomorrow anyway, because uh, I've got a couple bins to take. And um, my husband's going to come with me. And we have another a specific bin to take to go with a, a video that we're coming out with. If you watched my last one, my bins haul specifically for that. So I'm excited to see how that turns out. All right, this is all in motion, which I love for myself. It is, obviously this is all Target stuff. Uh, this is a size kids, large 10, 12. This is for my son for personal use. Some Cat and Jack size 12 uniform slacks. This is definitely a once upon a child item. And a dollar and 12 cents each. 
I expect to get at least that, so a break even or profit a little bit on the items that I take to Once Upon a Child, but to me that's worth it because I got some of the items that I want to keep for such a good deal. All right, there are some like random items in this box, like these are a pair of Hanes Girls size 14 underwear. Um, they are not in their package, but they are new. So I have got a lot of friends with kids of all ages, so some of this stuff just ends up hey, come to my house, go fishing on my lake, hang out, and bring me a couple seltzers, and I'll give you some free stuff for your kids. That's how we roll around here. All right, this is the brand. I actually hadn't heard of this one, and I buy, I like the Target swimsuits. This is Dream Suit by Miracle Brands. Like I said, I just hadn't heard of that, and this is a size 14 bathing suit. And you guys have heard me say before being here in Florida, I list bathing suits all year round because I buy bathing suits because we basically wear them all year here. So I know there are quite a bit of swimsuits in this. Kona Soul, size 20. I do love, well, is it gonna show you? That awkward time of day lighting. There we go, Kona Soul. Okay, I love this brand for swim. Now I will go ahead and uh, full transparency when I was buying this box and I saw that I had 15, 10 to 15 random swim items. I thought they were going to be kids swim items, which I would have preferred for our own personal use. But it turns out they're all women's, which is fine. They will sell. Um, even if I have to hang on to them for a little while, that's fine. There are some kids like this one. This is the uh, More Than Magic Girl size 10, 12. This will find itself in our size up bin because uh, it's only the next size up for my oldest. This is art class size seven, eight. This will go ahead and go right now into our bathing suit collection. Uh, my kids are in the pool every single day, usually at least twice a day. So we're using at least two bathing suits a day. And I love art class. They make some of the cutest Target stuff. There were a couple baby items like some um, organic onesies. This is gonna be a buy, sell, trade. Some little girls underwear. This will just be personal use. Same, well, these are like the uh, under, my kids wear this kind of stuff for the few short days, maybe weeks where we have to wear sweaters. So these are just some under tank tops for boys. Oh my gosh, so Michael's not here. He's actually off playing hockey tonight, but I, I don't read the whole manifest. I get to a certain point and I'm like, perfect, this box sounds great. These are some men's tidy whities and um, they were obviously like out of the package. They're still brand new, but I said, babe, there's something for you in my box. And I was just joking because I did open it and look through it really quickly. And he's, and he's the kind of guy, don't play with him because he will absolutely put these on and wear them through my house, acting a fool. And yeah, so now I have to keep them hidden. I don't know what I'm gonna do with these, but he will try to find a way to wear them and get himself in some sort of video or photo with, he's just a funny guy like that. So anyway, um, but some more Cat and Jack boxer briefs. Now these are a large 12, 14. I think the other ones were even, were bigger, right? No, they were the same. So these are, I don't know if I'm going to keep these or sell them because my son out of this size chart, honestly could probably still fit the small, which is a six, seven, even though he's 10. So there was one men's item in this entire box and uh, they're just good fellow. They're just some gray slacks and they are some chinos, size 32, 32. So um, my husband is more like a 31, 32, but I might just give him those. All right, these are some Cat and Jack girls underwear. We've got some socks, which is what I needed because I Look, I swear I wash the machine like everyone else's eats socks. And so I just am going to go through all of the socks. And now that we don't have uniforms, we don't have particular color socks, but I'm just going to throw away and start fresh. This is an exhilaration size medium, teeny tiny little swim top. Some boys t-shirts, size extra large, 18, 20. I'm probably going to see if my nephews want those. Um, this is another exhilaration size small. So there are a couple of these that I will probably end up putting together. These are for us. They are just some Cat and Jack socks. A whole package of them. My kids only wear socks to school. Besides that, we do not wear socks. Um, this is all kind of falling apart, but it's just some, just one new Carter's, I believe they're newborn, something like that. 
yeah, some onesies. So I will make this look a little bit nicer and throw this in the buy sell trade box. This is to keep, this is so cute. It's art class again. I love art class, a girl size seven, eight, like a cotton ribbed dress, super soft. I love it. These are some Kona sole size large swim shorts. This is, what are you? I don't know, some kind of swim top. Oh, here we go. Kona sole size 16, just a tankini top. This, there's a couple of these. This is more than magic size um, extra large girls, 14, 16 bathing suit. There's the top and the bottom. These are so cute. You've heard me say this before. Strawberry cell. These are Cat and Jack size 3T, just the bottoms. But I will probably put these up on Kittizen uh, because I know I personally shop that app for swim separates. My kids have never worn the same size top and bottom. Here's another pair of those with these uh, extra large bottoms. These I will just be keeping in our own swim. These are girls size small, so I'm super cute. They have like a little leopard design. Art class makes, I'm telling you, I've already said it five times, but art class from Target, they make some great stuff. The quality is great and a lot of it does hold its resale value because once it's sold out, Sometimes people do want to come back and search for those items. This is a Cat and Jack size six, seven shirt. And this will just be one of my own kids for school. And they're size 40. These are like a waffle knit. There are two of them. I believe it came in a two pack. I will list these up for sale. We do not do long sleeve shirts here ever just because it just doesn't get cold very often. And when it does, we just throw on a jacket. These are some little Cat and Jack 2T swim bottoms. This is like that cottage core look, a new day size large, this whole like, my husband likes to call it the little house on the prairie situation. <laughs> so I'll probably list that. It's more underwear that goes with the one from earlier. Cat and Jack baby size 12 months. This is so cute. It's like a, a linen material. I don't usually list super tiny things, but I will probably list that myself. This is an extra small art class size four or five. We will keep that. Um, just a little onesie. These are some cool pajamas. These are Cat and Jack size 16. These will probably go to the buy sell trade just because it will be a million years before my son could ever fit those. Some more organic onesies. So again, some of this stuff isn't super high retail value, but you have to remember I paid um, $75 for this box and like just with all of the socks and underwear, which is what I kind of was like, oh, I should probably grab some new of those for school. Um, sorry if I look a little blurry. The lighting, it's a weird time of day. Um, I feel like I'm already what I would have spent buying these items for myself. And so anything that I sell is just gonna be extra. And then the stuff I do take to buy, sell, trade to flip, I will take that as credit and then purchase items at the store that are then going to make me in the profit. So that's kind of my theory or philosophy with these boxes. Keep the stuff I want. This has the tag on top of it, so I can't tell what size they are, but I think they're like an extra large swim bottom. This, there is a matching bottom somewhere. So cute. This is a Minnie Mouse uh, rash guard. These are for my own daughter. They're just pair of cat and jack shorts, perfect for school. And these retail for $10, but I mean, I remember I'm paying a dollar and 12 cents. So to me, this was worth it. Oh my gosh, the cutest little bra. I told my husband, I said, I should probably keep this. We're gonna need that soon. I mean, not like soon, soon, but he about lost his mind. So it is so cute. Just a teeny little girl, size 32 little bra. I mean, I don't know, sixth grade. Is that when we're a couple years out? My son's going into fifth. Oh, not ready, y'all. All right, this is a 2T little rash guard. This is a really cute little, um, I, this is probably my favorite Target bathing suit brand. Where is it? Shade and Shore. There it is. And this is a size 34B. 
these I will keep for myself. They're also shade and shore, just a pair of pink bottoms. These are size 12 women's denizen Levi shorts. Some random boys boxer briefs that are my son size. And some girls underwears, which are my daughter size. And these, it's a 10 pack. Like these will probably, actually let me see. I have wondered this and y'all will find out with me if I scan any of these items, if they will still like show up using the Target app. Yep, $10.99 online from Target. I don't know if you can see that. $10.99, yep. So $11 underwear that now I don't have to go buy. Perfect. All right, this is just a size 4T Cat and Jack sweatshirt. There's another color of it, same thing. There are a couple of these Fortnite shirts. There's like a large and an extra large. There we go. Some more kids boxer briefs, which is perfect. These are some Honest Baby organic little uh, rubber band. These little, what are these called? Oh my gosh, I cannot, my brain is not working. A hat, a little hat. Yes, organic cotton ribbed hats. All right, these, I, I knew this was in the box, so I wanted this. This is a size seven, eight Cat and Jack little cardigan because my daughters love to wear dresses and they can't wear the little spaghetti strap dresses to school. Plus they usually keep it cold, so this will be perfect for my daughter to wear over a dress. Here is another one of those bottom size large. This is a exhilaration size small top. So I think there was like three or four size small bikini tops that I'll put all together. These are so comfy, they're an extra small. I wish they were my size. They are that, what's their sleepwear? Sun and stars, stars above. Just a little pair of sleep shorts. And like I said, most things do still have a tag and if they don't, they have it like taped to it. Some little girls undies. This is a Moana size 4T swim top. And this is Disney size 4T, another swim top. So I'll probably put these together. This is a Cat and Jack size 3T top. Some more undies. This is a size up for my daughter. So we will keep these for later this school year. So just in kids' underwear and socks and boxers, I'm already golden as far as I'm concerned. These are a size small, four, six, Kona sole swim top. This is Burt's Bees Organic Cotton, just a cute little baby hand-dyed dress. Oh my gosh, this is so cute, you guys. So this came in a little baggie. This was like on top when I first opened the box. Look at this teeny, it's size 12 months. Look at this little bikini. Oh my gosh, I remember my girls wearing stuff like this. Look at the tush, there's a little bow. Oh, so cute. So it's brand new, there's no tags, but precious. Um, these are some more boys tagless t-shirts. Um, these are actually my daughter, my youngest daughter's size, but they've kind of gotten into the whole tie-dye thing, so. Now we've got four shirts that we can tie dye. This is a really cute, I have had great luck selling the Auden and all the other Target brand bras. I've never seen this brand. I haven't been into a Target in a while in that section. It's called All You Lively Sporty Meets Femme. So it's a size large little bra that's kind of like bralette and sports bra all in one. This is all in motion, size extra small, like a workout tank. And another size 4T, 5T, these are cute. These are little camisoles for girls. This is my daughter's size. So when we do have a little sweater season, these are great for layering. So I will be keeping these for her. So that's my box, um, $75 for all of that. So personally, I think that is a pretty great deal. And I love the website. So. If you haven't checked it out, it's a very easy to use website. You just have to kind of create your username and password and then 
search for whatever it is you're searching for or just aimlessly scroll boxes. I have done that a few times, but it's great. It's by category. You can search clothing, general merchandise, um, electronics, any of those things. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.